Hello. In this video, we are going to discuss how to configure the allowable attachment types by their extensions in DWP. There's a little change in 2002 compared to previous versions. In 2002, you use the tenant config scripts to set the values, and that's detailed in the documentation, and we're going to run through that as well. And after you do that, you clear the browser cache to set the files. And in pre-2002, you update the app config JSON file, and you'd have to restart Tomcat and clear the browser cache. So let's take a quick run through each one of these on a system. Okay, so here's my 2002 box, and I want to attach a file to this request. It's an XML file, and I see that it says I get it's unsupported. So what we want to do is we want to allow that. So what we'll do is this. So we see this is a script you run. Set it, I'm on a Windows box, so it's a bat file. So essentially, all I'm going to do is edit that file, save it, and then just run the script. OK, so my script is completed. So now that you have to clear the browser cache, so what I'm going to do is I'll just go ahead and just log out and start a new private window and then log back in again. OK, so here's my box back after I've cleared the cache. I'm going to log in again. And now when I go to attach, my XML file, I don't get any kind of complaint. And then I submit the request. And we've now got the request open that I'd submitted. And there's my file. It did, did, it did pass through. So now this data is stored in the database, this attachment format table. And you can see all the ones that aren't allowed there. So these, and, and this updates each time you run the script, this will be updated. So that is what controls the setting in 2002. So now we're on a pre-2002 system. It's going to be the same thing. I'm going to try to attach a file, XML file. I get the same message. It's not supported. So pre-2002, we would edit this file, the app config JSON file. I remove XML from the list. And then we need to restart Tomcat. OK, so my Tomcat's back up. I've got a new private window started, so my cache should be cleared. So we log back in to DWP. And we're going to attach our file. It gets added. Submit the request. And we can just check the request real quick. OK, so here's our request. And we see our attachment there. So it allowed the XML file to pass when initially it did. Thank you for your time.